It's time for the Celebrity Family Feud. It's a shark attack we've got. The cast of Shark Tank playing for Junior Achievement USA. But hoping to talk things out is the cast of The Talk playing for Boys and Girls Clubs of America. And now, the star of our show, Steve Harvey. What's up, man? Hmm. How you doing, ma'am? How's everybody? Good, good. I appreciate everybody. I do. Thank y'all very much. Yeah, I do. Well, welcome to Celebrity Family Feud, everybody. I'm your man, Steve Harvey. We got a good one for you for tonight. These two celebrity teams are going to be battling out for 25000 bucks for their favorite charity. Y'all ready for the show to get started? Everybody say yeah. All right, let's play the few. Give me Mark, give, give me Natalie. <laughs> Folks, top eight answers on the board. Name something a man might keep under his toppy for emergencies. <laughs> Natalie. Keys, keys. Mm. Mark. Money, money. Mm. Pass to play. We're going to play, Steve. All right, they're going to play. Damon, name something a man might keep under his toppy for emergencies. I'll say his credit card. His credit card. Mm. Oh. Lori, one strike. Name something a man might keep under his toppy for emergencies. Knife. Knife. Mm. Knife. Mm. Robert. Name something a man might keep under his toppy for emergencies. Cigarettes. Cigarettes. Mm. Emma. Name something a man might keep under his top before emergencies. Glue. Glue. Mm. Mark. Only one strike. Name something a man might keep under his top P for emergencies. Cell phone. His cell phone. <laughs> Damon, we got two strikes. We got to be careful. We got to slow it down. The talk can steal. Name something a man might keep under his toppy for emergencies. Mm. Mm. 
They aim something a man might keep under his top before emergencies. Condom. Condom! Mm. Number eight. Gun. Five. Another toppy. Let's move on to question two. Give me Damon. Give me Jerry. Gentlemen. Top five answers on the board. Name the only kind of music they play all day and night in hell. Damon. Rap. Rap. Jerry. Country. Country. Mm. Pass the play. Pass. They're going to pass. Lori, name the only kind of music they play all day and night in hell. Hard walk, hard walk, hard walk. Mm. Mm. Robert. Two answers left. Name the only kind of music they play all day and night in hell. Christmas music. Christmas music. Mm. Emma, one strike. Name the only kind of music they play all day and night in hell. Classical, classical. Mm. All right, Mark, we got two strikes. We gotta be careful. The talk can't steal. Name the only kind of music they play all day and night in hell. Nursery rhymes. Nursery rhymes. <laughs> Natalie, name the only kind of music they play all day and night in hell. Steve, I gotta go with pop. Pop. Mm. Number four, opera. The talk, 144, the sharks, not on the board. The goal is 300 points. Again, you got a long way to go. You're playing well, folks. We'll be back right after this. Welcome back to Celebrity Family Feud, everybody. We got a good one.
The Talk 144. The Sharks not on the board. Give me Lori. Give me Cheryl. Ladies, point values are double. Top five answers on the board. Name something that gets split. Cheryl. Log. Log. We're going to play, Steve. All right. Akbar, name something that gets split. Bill. 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 Drew, name something that gets split. Hair. Hair. Natalie, name something that gets split. Your cheeks, your cheeks. Jerry, only one strike. Name something that gets split. A loaf of bread. A loaf of bread. Mm. All right, Cheryl, we got two strikes. We got to be careful. The sharks can steal. Name something that gets split. Your wig. Your wig. Name something that gets split. What about pants? Mm. Pants. Number four, an atom, three, banana. Let's move on to the next question. Give me Robert, give me Akbar. Gentlemen, point values are triple. Top four answers on the board. Name something about Miss Piggy that's different from most pigs. Robert? Her voice, her voice. Pass the play, play, they're gonna play. Mm -hmm. Emma, name something about Miss Piggy that's different from most pigs. Has blonde hair. 
has blonde hair. Mark, name something about Miss Piggy that's different from most pigs. She wears clothes. She wears clothes. Damon. One answer left. If it's there, your team gets to play sudden death. If it's not there, you stay alive. No strikes. Name something about Miss Piggy that's different from most pigs. She's fat. She's fat. Lori, one strike. Name something about Miss Piggy that's different from most pigs. She's in love with Kermit. This is for sudden death. She's in love with Kermit. Nobody reached 300 points, so we're going to play Sudden Death. Give me Emma, give me Drew. Everybody, with this survey, we're asking for the top answer only. Whoever get this one answer will win the game. Good luck to both of you. Here we go. Name something people take two of at a time. Emma. Pills. Pills. y'all team we're gonna make a donation to your favorite charity for coming hanging out with us hey I need two players I got Robert and I got Mark we're gonna play fast money right after this folks You ready? Yes. 20 seconds on the clock. We asked 100 women. Fill in the blank. My date looked great, but he blank funny. Smelled. On a scale of 1 to 10, how good a president do you think you'd make? Seven, now a place you never want to spend a lot of time. Jail, name someone you call when you need cheering up. Wife, name a part of you that jiggles just a little too much. Stomach. We asked 100 women to fill in the blank. Excuse me. We asked 100 women. Fill in the blank. My date looked great, but he blank funny, you said. Smelled. Survey, sir. On a scale of 1 to 10, how good a president do you think you'd make, you said? 
Seven survey said. Name a place you never want to spend a lot of time, you said. Jail, survey said. Name someone you call when you need cheering up, you said. Wife, survey said. Name a part of you that jiggles just a little too much, you said. Stomach, survey said. Mark, yes sir. Robert got 115 points. You need 85 points. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Reminds everybody of Robert's answers. 25 seconds on the clock. We asked 100 women, fill in the blank. My date looked great but he blank funny walked on a scale of one to ten how good a president do you think you'd make five name a place you never want to spend a lot of time strip club name someone you call when you need cheering up friend name a part of you that jiggles just a little too much Booty. We asked 100 women, fill in the blank. My date looked great, but he blank funny, you said. Walked, survey said. Smelled was the number one answer. On a scale of 1 to 10, how good a president do you think you'd make? You said. 5, survey said. Uh. 5 was the number one answer. Name a place you never want to spend a let. Excuse me, name a place you never want to spend a lot of time, you said. Strip club, survey said. Jail was the number one answer. Name someone you called when... Excuse me, name someone you call when you need cheering up. You said, Friend, service said. Friend was the number one answer. Name a part of you that jiggles just a little too much, she said. Booty, service said. Stomach. Or belly was the number one answer. That's twenty, excuse me. That's ten thousand dollars for Dream Year Achievement USA. I want to think. The, the sharks and the talk for coming hanging out with us on Celebrity Family Feud. Stay tuned, everybody. We're going to have two brand new teams when Celebrity Family Feud continues.
Welcome back to Celebrity Family Feud, everybody. Let's meet our next two teams. It's your favorite players from the NFL Players Association. And they're playing for the Conscious Kid Foundation. And they're taking on their moms. Who are playing for the Black Women's Health Imperative. Y'all ready for the show to get started? Everybody say yeah. Yeah. All right, let's play the feud. Let's get it on. Give me Grady. Give me Elisha. <laughs> Folks, top six answers on the board. Name something a prisoner might do that would annoy his cellmate. Elisha. Sing. Sing. Pass the play. We're gonna play. They're gonna play. Melissa, name something a prisoner might do that would annoy his cellmate. Talk too much. Talk too much. Mm. All right. Tiana. Name something a prisoner might do that would annoy his cellmate. Snore. Snore. <laughs> Stephanie, name something a prisoner might do that would annoy his cellmate. Smoking cigarettes. Smoking cigarettes. Tanjalia, only one strike. Name something a prisoner might do that would annoy his cellmate. Crush on him. Prisoners are kept crushing on this dude <laughs> crush on him <laughs> Elisha and something a prisoner might do that would annoy his soulmate smell smell Melissa, we got two strikes. We got to be careful. The NFLPA can't steal. Name something a prisoner might do that would annoy his soulmate. Eat all the food. Eat all the food. Name something a prisoner might do that would annoy his cellmate. Fight. Fight. Mm. Fight. Get gassy. Three. Whistle. Let's move on to question two. Give me Christian. Give me Melissa.
All right, top eight answers on the board. We asked 100 men, name something you'd do if you pick your blind date up and she was a nudist. Melissa. Clap. Clap. Christian. Smile. Smile. Pass the play. We're going to play. They're going to play. Nanji, we asked 100 men, name something you do if you pick your blind dates up and she was the uh, nudist. Get naked. Get naked. Mm. Stefan. We asked 100 men, name something you'd do if you pick your blind date up and she was a nudist. Um, Tao, Tao. Clyde, we asked 100 men, name something you'd do if you pick your blind day up and she was a nudist. Hand her flowers, hand her flowers. Grady, one strike. We asked 100 men, name something you'd do if you pick your blind day up and she was the nudist. Have you showered? Have you showered? Christian, mm. we got two strikes. We gotta be careful. The other team can steal. We asked 100 men, name something you'd do if you pick your blind day up and she was the nudist. Um, take her picture. Take her picture. We asked 100 men, name something you'd do if you pick your blind date up and she was a nudist. Beg for sex. Beg for sex. Number six. Blush. Shocked for get dressed three stare enjoy view NFL PA moms one thirty one NFL PA on the board the goal is three hundred points again we got a long way to go.
We'll be back right after this, folks. Welcome back to Celebrity Family Feud, everybody. We got a good one. NFL PA Moms 131. NFL PA not on the board. Give me Najee, give me Tiana. All right, point values are double. Top six answers on the board. Name another word for stink. Tiana. P-U, P-U. Naji Stench Stench mm. Pass the play Play, they're gonna play Stefan, name another word for stink. Stunk. Stunk. Mm. Clyde. One strike. Name another word for stink. Funky. Funky. Mm. Brady, we got two strikes. We got to be careful. The NFL moms can steal. Name another word for stink. Smell. Smell. Mm. Christian, name another word for stink. Scent. Scent. Mm. Scent. Mm. Name another word for stink. Odor. Odor. Number six. Fool. Four. Reek. Let's move on to the next question. Give me Stefan. Give me Stephanie. All right, point values are triple. Top four answers on the board. Name something in the ocean you wouldn't want to get in your swimsuit. Stephanie. Fish. Fish. Mm. Pass the play. Play. They're going to play. Mm. 
Tanjalia. Name something in the ocean you wouldn't want to get in your swimsuit. Fishing hook. Fishing hook. Elisha. Mm. One strike. Name something in the ocean you wouldn't want to get in your swimsuit. Sea urchin. Sea urchin. <laughs> Melissa, we got two strikes. If it's not there, the NFL players can steal and and play sudden death. Sand. Sand. Tiana, name something in the ocean you wouldn't want to get in your swimsuit. Crab, crab. <laughs> Stephanie, one answer left. If it's there, your team wins the game. But this time, you got two strikes. If it's not there... The NFL players can steal and play sudden death. Name something in the ocean you wouldn't want to get in your swimsuit. Seaweed. This is for the win. Seaweed. I'm proud of y'all, team. We're going to make a donation to your favorite charity for hanging out with us. Hey, I need two players. I got Tanjalia and I got Melissa. We're going to play Fast Money right after this, folks. Welcome back to Celebrity Family Feud, everybody. The NFL players' moms won the game. And now it's time to play Fast Money. All right, Melissa, Tanjalia is off stage. I'm going to ask you five questions in 20 seconds. If you can't think of something, just hit pass. You and Tanjalia together to reach 200 points. Look right there and tell everybody how much you're going to win and what charity are you playing for. $25,000 for the Black Women's Health Imperative. Mm. You ready? Yes. 20 seconds on the clock. Fill in the blank. Lock your doors a blank. Just escape from the zoo. Lion. On a scale of 1 to 10, how awesome are you? 10. Name something a child might do right before he goes to bed. Brush teeth. Tell me what you think is Santa's favorite cookie. Chocolate chip. Give me the first letter only of the curse word you use most often. S. Fill in the blank. Lock your doors. A uh, blank just escaped from the zoo, you said. Lion, survey said. On a scale of 1 to 10, how awesome are you, you said. 10, survey said. 
Name something a child might do right before he goes to bed, you said. Brush teeth, survey said. Tell me what you think is Santa's favorite cookie, you said. Chocolate chip, survey said. Give me the first letter only of the curse word you use most often, you said. S, survey said. Tanjalia? Yes, sir. Melissa got 165 points. You need 35 points. You ready? Yes. Reminds everybody of Melissa's answers. 25 seconds on the clock. Fill in the blank. Lock your doors. A blank just escaped from the zoo. Bear. On a scale of 1 to 10, how awesome are you? 10. Uh uh, try again. 8. Name something a child might do right before he goes to bed. Read a book. Tell me what you think is Santa's favorite cookie. Sugar. Give me the first letter only of the curse word you use most often. F. Hmm. Fill in the blank. Lock your doors. A blank just escaped from the zoo, you said. Bear, survey said. Lion was the number one answer. On a scale of one to 10, how awesome are you, you said. About an eight, survey said. Ten was the number one answer. Brush teeth was the number one answer. Sugar was the number one answer. Give me the first letter only of the curse word you use most often. F was the number one answer. Well. That's $25,000 for a black women's health imperative. I want to thank the NFL players and the NFL moms for coming hanging out with us on Celebrity Family Feud. I'm Steve Harvey. We'll see you next time, folks.